Hello, Jason here. Today is August 17th, and this is your aftermarket update. So it was uh, a good day here at the Oil Trading Group. I uh, did want to take a minute to show you the OTG trade of the day here. Uh, first thing, though, I want to show you is this chart. I want you to, I'm going to draw your attention to the bottom left-hand corner here. We'll zoom in on it for just a second. You'll notice that the daily range today was 105 uh, ticks. The average 10-day range was 160 ticks. And the average 20-day range is 156 ticks. So very narrow range today at 105 ticks. Uh, that is uh, very difficult, makes for very difficult and choppy trading conditions. The other thing that we're in the middle of here right now, and in fact, Wednesday is the last day of the September contract. And as I make this video here now, I look over at the uh, contract split and the October contract is already uh, has more contracts traded than the September contract. And we have just uh, opened for the day for the next trading session. So the overnight session. So again, uh, this is a tricky time of the month to trade, as we know. Uh, contract rollover period uh, does provide its challenges. The volume is split uh, between the two contracts, and it does make for choppy and bouncy trading conditions. And so the chart that you're looking at here today uh, is evidenced of, you can see the evidence of that. Uh, we'll draw a line here. Uh, let's see, we want this uh, vertical line here right at the 8 o'clock a.m. hour. There is, and let's make this a little bigger and a color that you can see more readily. In fact, we'll just do it like that. And between this time frame here at the open, uh, we, candle bodies, now I'm measuring the candle bodies here, 41.78 up to 42.08, that's 30 ticks. We did not get out of a 30 tick range for the first almost two hours of the trading day today. And then we only, again, from a candle body perspective, uh, up to 64. So we went from 78 to 64. That's 96 ticks low to high uh, during really the first almost three, four hours of the session today. In fact, we didn't make it back down again until... Uh, right here at the close. So very narrow, choppy trading range here today. Uh, that is the hallmark of crude oil inventory, sorry, of crude oil inventory, of contract rollover week. Uh, we will be rolling to the new contract, it looks like, here tomorrow, and we'll talk some more about that. So the OTG trade of the day, actually, uh, we had our trade plan. Uh, we had a difficult uh, set of conditions in this area here today, and I'm going to show you uh, the performance numbers from today so you get a good feeling for what today's uh, trade of the day was um, but and that will be in the blog post that accompanies this video and we'll, we'll have a write-up about that as well but we what we ultimately did is we got in here uh, this is part of the OTG trade plan we got in here at this level at the 4216 area and we wrote it to our target right up here uh, at the 60 level right in this area right here. And so that's what you're going to see. The trade of the day is about 15 minutes long. You're going to see that. What you're also going to see is the new order entry technique uh, that we are doing here at the Oil Trading Group. So instead of, again, as you notice, you've, if you've been keeping up with what we're doing here, you know that we've gone from a uh, all-in scale-out strategy to a scale-in all-out strategy. And we'll spend some time, again, as we as we go through the blog here today, and I write the blog around this video, um, you'll see exactly the benefits that we've been able to, to generate out of that. But suffice it to say, uh, the losing trades that we had leading into this, uh, this one trade wiped all of those out and put us up on a uh, nice profit today. One of the things that you see happens here is we do have these OTG bands, and we go, again, we call it going step to step or band to band. So we went from step to step, back up to this step, came back down, back to this step, all the way down to this final step down here. So we're, um, again, this is part of the OTG support and resistance program uh, that we uh, look at here on a daily basis. But the primary focus for today is this OTG trade of the day. It was 138 ticks from 42.16 up to 42.60. So without further ado, here is the OTG trade of the day. One triple bottom at 21, down to 17, and I'm in at 16.
Stop is 06. <clears throat> we need 16 to hold. Obviously. Stop is 06. We'll go to auto break even at 26. If we make it up there, 108, limit orders long at 17. Auto break even at 26. 31 and 41 on the ad spots. Come on, get through 17, 18, back up through it. Now we need 16 to work in our favor here to hold on the short side. Or, yeah, hold, keep the momentum from getting short. And then we'll target at the top 61. That's the target up top. We'll see. Six is the stop. Need to close above 18 here. Close above that structure signal. We hit the market structure mid. 18, 17, 16. We got to get up through 22 and then 26. So this is what I'm doing. I'll be right back. I'm, I'm going to quit watching it here for just a second. You see where I'm at? I'm going to get some water. I'll be right back. It's either going to go or it's not. All right, come on, get through that 22. 22, I told you we have a line in the sand there at 22. We get to 26, it goes to auto break even. Let's see if we can't push this up to 60 up there. 22, come on, 23, 24, hit 23, there we go. Now 24, three ticks away from moving it to break even here. And this really... This really should go for us. There's 26, 25. I'm going to go ahead and put it at auto break even. We hit 25. That's close enough. Adding at 31. The add at 31 will bring the stale, uh, the uh, trail stop to 21. There's 25. You got an iceberg order at 25. Okay. Come on. Hit through to 26. There's 25. No takers up there at 26, but I'm going to be at break even now. I am at break even here. 26, 27. All right. Adding at 31. Going to add at 31. All it takes is one. All it takes is one nice ride. Guys, that's all it takes. The exit is up here at 60. If we can make it. No guarantees, of course, but that is where the exit is. An add at 31, there's 30, 31, brings the trail stop to 21. Okay. Brings your trail stop to 21. See if we can make it up to 60. 41 is the next ad spot. Brings your trail stop to 26. Target is 60. All 
All it takes is one. 26 would be the trail stop here. 26. And then we'll see. Would sure be nice to go ahead and do us right. 157 short at 40. 157 limit order short at 40. Can't quite tag through your 32 yet. 16 and a half minutes till we get into the close. And then we'll see. 60 is the final target up top. The trail stop here is 21. If it takes me out, it's just one of those days. But we know it's not a loser at this point. 215 hit the offer up here at 30. You've got an iceberg order at 30. If we can break 30, which we just did, that's a good sign. But now we need to get through 32. We've not hit 32 yet. You've got the, there's 33, good, 34. Okay, you've got some orders stacked up up here. If we get in here again, 26 becomes the trail stop. 60 is the target. We got up to 34. Come on, push us through here. Push us up through. 175, limit order short at 40. You got structure target at 43, revision target at 53. And now you need to push through 34. 50, 30 seconds here till the 15 minute candle. Golly, it's just like pushing rocks up a hill. The October contract's at 4285 right now. That's where the price on that is. It's like pushing a boulder uphill here at the moment. Okay, new 15 minute bar. You got 15 minutes till the European session close now. High up there is 39. You got a one, two, three, four top at 38. You got a four top at 38. So you got 176 short at 40, 90 at 41, and then 187 at 43. You got a lot of stuff going on up there. But that's I'm going to stick to the plan here on the ad spots. There's 33. We got to get through 34. <clears throat> and then 60 is the target. All right, push through 33 to 34. 61 is your target. Thirty-six just hit the offer up there at thirty-four. Trail stop is twenty-one. I'd like to see us pop that thirty-four. Triple top at 34. Oh, don't. Don't start sliding down the hill here. Keep me in this thing. 27, 28. Uh, uh, 22 is a tough little spot here. I'm at 21 on the stop. I'm trying to limp into the close here. 
or feel like if we can get into the close, we'll continue this push up. If we can make this into the close here, no guarantees, of course. There's 24. Just no love here. Double top at 34. Need this to hold and get back up through it. Come on, get yourself back up through 28, 29 here. Come on, get up through 28. There we go, 30, 31. Let's go attack 34 again. 30. Come on, 30, 31. Sellers backing away at 30. There's some at 31. Now let's go 32, 33. There's 31 again. Nothing at 32. Buyers, sellers backing away at 31. We need to hit the bid at 32. Hit the offer at 32. There we go. Now 33. Now fight your way up through that 33 to 34. The orders are way thinner now up ahead of us than what they were a minute ago, which is a good sign, although you've got a little bit of an iceberg coming back here at 32. You've got uh, 9, 10, 11 minutes. Till, there's 35. That's a good sign. Break that triple top up there. There's 36, 37, 38, 39. There's the high. Boy, lots of orders up here. I'm in at 41 now. Again. Trail stop is 26. Let's see, 41. Filled it up there. Let's see if we can now get through 41 and all of those orders up there at 41. See if we can move this thing, the final 20 ticks here. Okay, settlement is up there at 50. You've got big time orders stacked up up here. The structure targets at 43, revision targets at 53. This is all it takes. This is all it will take to get done what we need to get done if we can get through up here to 60. Stop is 26. There's 37, 38. Got to get through 40, 41. 200 limit order short at 43. 10 minutes, nine and a half minutes till the bottom of the hour. And I think we'll make it to 60. There's 42. Now get through 43. There's 42. Come on, 43. You've got orders stacked up around you up there at settlement. 42. Let's go 43, 44. 202 limit order short at 43, but you've got an iceberg at 41 trying to keep the floor underneath it. Okay, you've had you've got an iceberg at 42 as well. 161 on the offer at 42. We should break it here, I believe. Come on, we got a slam home. You've got an iceberg on both sides here. Both of these 41 and 42 are duking it out here. 229, you've got more buyers than sellers. We're 18 ticks away from the home here. Away from finishing the target up here. Let's go. Good. 46. Good. Okay, settlement's up there at 50. I'm going to go ahead and protect here 10 ticks to 36. There's 54, 55, 56, 57. Looking to get to 60. Come on. Get up through 56, 57. Looking to get to the target. There's 56. Come on. 56, 57. Let's squeeze this into 41 here. 42 on the trail stop. That's 16 ticks on the trail stop. Get up through it here. Come on, we got to 57. Uh, come on, stay above settlement. We got right into the zone up there. One more push up is what we're looking for here. 53, 54. Jeez, come on. Fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two. Come on, bring this trail stop to forty-six. Twenty ticks to forty-six. Break even plus twenty to forty-six. There's fifty-three, fifty-four. Looking to get up there to sixty. Finish it. 
You've got uh, two and a half minutes left on this bar. Get up through it here. Come on, stay above 50. Come on. Come on. 53, 54. Go fight through 55, 56, 57. There's 58, 59. 60 and out. How you like that? Sweet. Cool. We needed that. There you go. All right. So I was a little excited there at the end. I admit it. Um, it was such a choppy day leading into that trade. Uh, we missed an earlier opportunity that we should have taken uh, right around the open, but I went ahead and passed on it and. Uh, ended up being a winner. We wouldn't have had to trade all the way to the end of the European session. But nonetheless, uh, you did hear my excitement there at the end, and it was ended up being a really nice day. So with our new money management uh, and order entry system, let's call it an order entry system, uh, it has provided us with the ability to really reduce the initial risk and maximize when we are on a run, and you were able to see that happen there in the trading video uh, that we just showed you. So again, as always, I want to say thank you for spending time watching us here at the Oil Trading Group. Uh, we certainly appreciate uh, the time you spend here with us. And until tomorrow, I want to wish you good luck and good trading.